All right, so this is mind blowing. I've been using ChatGPT for the last month or so, and it actually changed my perspective on how you can learn new things using the artificial, using that uh, OpenAI model that you should sign up for it right now. Now, it's not just about configuring 48 it's about anything anything that you want to learn so let's start all right so the very first thing that you should do is to head over to openai just uh click on the try sign in and start the experience now trust me once you're here you will not leave chat gpt you will continue to use it in different scenarios if you have any question on powershell any question on http javascript if you're planning to configure a cisco switch or router you will ask oh chat gpt now it is build wisely it is built as a conversation uh, between you and chat gpt and you're all focused on understanding things just come up equipped with questions and curiosity so i've been playing around and asking chat gpt how to configure uh, different things with powershell how to write up scripts how to write up models uh, doing just about anything and lately i've been uh i've i've been playing around with asking chat gpt how to configure different things on a 48 firewall so just head over to new chat and let's start let's ask chat gpt how to configure an interface on a 48 firewall all right now it will sometimes have latency but most of the time it just works fast so uh you will see that it actually uh, shows you um code samples that you can copy and it actually shows you different methods to do specific things now this is the way that you do it on the graphical user interface on a 48 firewall now let's ask these same questions but now how to configure an interface on a 48 using the command line all right now there it is it starts and shows you how you do it using the command line and you can as i said you can copy the code don't copy it just write it down that's the best way to learn to configure a 48 firewall let's just let it finish and ask him another question i'll be focusing on the command line how to configure let's assume that you have configured an, an interface and now you wish to configure a static route on a 40 gate using command line and there it is it actually tells you what to do it explains what you are doing and it shows you different ways to do the same thing now if you follow along you can of course uh, scroll up scroll down and see the whole conversation so that you will actually get into things in a much more focused way all right now 
it shows you how to configure um, a static route. So let's just ask it um, configure HA on a 48 with the command line. And there it is to configure high availability. And there it shows you all the steps that are needed, starting from the config system global set HA and so on. And you are probably familiar with the different ways you can do so. But again, just add, just ask it anything that you wish to learn you can configure your 48 you can configure your checkpoint you can configure your palo alto or cisco switch you can actually configure anything it doesn't just shows you the code it shows you the whole process and it explains it perfectly all right now let's uh, end up with uh, another question um let's um let's ask it to configure a 40 analyzer let's enter let's see what it shows us all right now again log in to the web base you know what let's just uh ask it another question what is uh the default ip address of a 48 uh, out of the box Now I have a typo here, but it will understand my question. All right, let's just let it finish. Now you can see that the steps are actually uh, very clear. And again, let's ask it how do you configure no sorry what is the default ip address of a 40 gate firewall now out of the box as everyone knows it is 192 168 199 